What's good, YouTube? Today's video, I want to talk about how to know if somebody has demonic spirits on them. Now, there's many ways to tell if somebody has demonic spirits on them. But the main way to tell if somebody has demonic spirits on them is if you stand next to somebody and as soon as you stand next to them, they instantly hold their stomach and they run to the bathroom. Now, it don't have to happen in that order. Basically, what I'm saying is this. Look, okay, if you somebody like me that gets some energy, you get the moon energy, you know, whenever the moon be out, because, you know, they be trying to play with the moon and shit. But um, you get moon energy, you get some energy, you know what I'm saying? You get light, you know what I'm saying? You a light being, you see what I'm saying? Everything about you is light. And if you look in somebody's eyes and they, like, just looking crazy and stuff like that, it's like your it's like your light so powerful that you could burn their eyes out just by staring at them. You see what I'm saying? That's why you really can't get eye contact to everybody because they they be scared to look at you because they know that they can tell you got so much power in you. You know, so you could literally burn their eyes out. But that's one way. You know what I'm saying? Like if you look somebody in their eyes and they just can't look you in the eyes. You know what I'm saying? That's how you can tell somebody got demons on them. But the real way to tell somebody got demons on them is when you stand next to somebody. And they instantly just got to go to the bathroom or they constantly keep going to the bathroom, you know, take a number two, take a shit, whatever. Now, basically, what this means is that your energy, your aura field around your body is so strong that it knocks the shit out their weak ass solar plexus. Because, you know, everybody say, well, you have to take a number two. They say, I got to get this demon out of me. You see what I'm saying? When you take a shit, people always say, I got to get this demon out of me. Because basically, the foods they've been eating, you know what I'm saying, the liquor they've been drinking, you know what I'm saying? And, like, it's funny because, like, I be trying to drink liquor, you know what I'm saying? But it's like my body don't even drink it no more. Like, I be buying OEs and shit, old English. I be buying that shit, and I don't, I don't even be finishing that shit. So I be wasting a dollar and 62 cents. It's like my body just reject that shit because, like... That's how you could tell if you transform it, if your body can't take some of the old stuff. And I know I'm supposed to be talking about demons and whatnot, but you know I got to incorporate other things. But if you eat something and you go to the bathroom instantly, that's because it's, it's no good. Because what your body usually does is it takes a while for you to go to the bathroom. Not like a while, but your body holds in the food, get all the nutrients, then you got to go to the bathroom. But if you got to go to the bathroom instantly, right after you eat something, it's poison because your body getting rid of the shit. It don't want it. It don't have no nutrients in it at all. So you got to shit it out instantly. But that's the same thing with people with demons on them. Because every time somebody got to take a shit, they like, oh, I got to get this demon out of me. Basically, it's like your aura field, your energy, your being, you know what I'm saying? Your person is just so strong that you be around them. They body's not strong enough. And them demons, demons hate light. You see what I'm saying? So them demons got to get out their body. got to get away from you somehow. So they got to go to the bathroom and take a shit to release them evil spirits. Real talk, people. That's how you know somebody got demons on you. Pay attention, okay? Don't think everything is a coincidence. Pay attention. You stand next to somebody, and they all of a sudden just, damn, hold on, I, I think I got to go to the bathroom. They wasn't saying this, but just because they weren't saying it, you don't know if they got to go to the bathroom or not. But out the blue, you just stand next to somebody, a random person, a family member, whoever. Next, you know, they like, damn, I got to take a shit real quick. They got demons on them. You see what I'm saying? Because they can't stand next to your light. Real talk. Now, if you stand next to somebody, and they spiritual just like you, and they full of light just like you, you stand next to them, they just going to look at you like, okay. You know what I'm saying? Because their energy strong as yours. So your energy bouncing off their body, they good. Because people don't understand. Like I say, law of oneness. We all connected whether you believe it or not. So you can stand next to somebody. Your energy bouncing off their energy. Y'all don't even got to talk. It's just because energy connects to other energy. Just like a magnet. Or you think magnets attract other magnets because it's all energy. Energy doesn't care what it is. If it, if it can feel another energy, it's going to attract to it. You see what I'm saying? It's all, it's all about energy, people. If you learn how to control your breathing, you learn how to control your energy, you can take over the whole world. And people just don't even understand that shit. Real talk. That's why I be trying to laugh at people like, real shit, man. I know about this energy shit. I do this shit every day, 24-7. And if you add them numbers up, that equal 13, nigga. 